Welcome everyone to the next step for our dinosaur project. So today is two things. We're going to outline with permanent marker and then we are going to add color, but the color has to be no more than two, two colors um, total. Okay. So you get to design your dinosaur in whatever color you think, but you can only use two colors to do it. So we'll talk about that. All right, um, mine is outlined in um, pen, but I want you guys to have a little thicker outline if possible. All right, um, so we're going to go over the pencil lines with the permanent marker. Okay. If you have lines that you did not want on your paper, um, talk to me and we can do some other steps. Um, but I'm not going to explain that to everyone. Most of you are going to be just fine doing your dinosaur how you have it. So, And the reason that we're doing these lines with the thicker black is just that it's going to give you a little bit more of a barrier for your color or a thicker wall so that you don't go outside of the lines when you're coloring. If the video had you drawing some other lines on here, you can go over those. My circles are turning into solid black dots, but Um, you'll notice I did not do the eye. Um, I just didn't want to color it all in. We can, you can ask me if you have a tiny little eye. Um, please ask me for another marker. I have some of those extra fine point. Okay, so now that I have everything on here outlined, now I am going to pick out a couple, two um, colors. And you guys are able to use colored pencil or crayons. So here's a colored pencil. Um, again, I said colored pencil or crayons, or you can use both. So if you choose one of your colors to be purple, you can choose different tints or shades of that one color. So you can have a uh, lighter purple, a darker purple, um, a regular purple, and those all count as one color. All right, so I'm going to make my dinosaur purple and my second color is going to be gray. Okay. Again, you can be as creative as you want. My picky teacher uh, thing is that I need you guys to stay inside the lines. Okay. So I am going to lightly go over my entire dinosaur because this is what I want to do with the gray okay and then i'll explain how i'm going to come back and add the purple for those of you that want to have fun and design your own and make it as crazy as you want with the two colors that you have um, you can do so. Um, I don't think there was any neon dinosaurs, but again, I'm giving you that option. Um, think of things like crocodiles. Um, they are, you know, a 
grayish, greenish um, color. These are more reptilian, but we also have reptiles and lizards that are um, some pretty bright, crazy colors. So who knows? Um, I don't think we know what the dinosaurs truly look like. So you have that opportunity to make things your own. All I ask is that you stay inside the lines and you only use two colors max. If you want to make this whole dinosaur just gray, go for it. Um, but I would listen to the next step where we kind of go up and we think about darker areas and all that. Okay, so I have my dinosaur gray. And so now I'm going to come in and now I'm going to add some more detailed I'm gonna imagine that my dinosaur had a darker belly. And then maybe some purple. Along the nose. So what I'm doing here is kind of pushing harder in some areas. That gives me a totally different purple. And I'm kind of mixing the colors. My face I'm doing lighter. My arms and feet and legs I'm doing a little bit lighter. Then I'm pushing a little harder on this back part to So that is how I'm using the two colors. Again, do you have to do that? Nope. Um, I could have added some dark stripes. Maybe I'll still do that. And you guys have Chromebooks, so feel free to um, search some dinosaur you know, you can type in uh, T-Rex and you'll see plenty of what scientists and different things thought the dinosaurs looked like. Right. So those are my stripes without actually being too stripey. All right. So that is all we're doing. Now you'll notice I did not draw anything for the ground. Okay. If your picture did it and you added a little bit, you're fine but I have nothing in the background, no trees, no volcanoes, no uh, trees like palm trees or anything like that. Nothing goes in the back. We are going to be doing something in the background that um, will be pretty much the opposite of what you are expecting. So um, with that, everything is colored on mine um, and that's how I wanna have it. You're gonna be able to use your own imagination to add color to yours however you wish. But again, remember, you're only using two colors. You get to choose those two colors, but no more than two colors. Good luck.